Finally, let's talk about the Golden Guardians. Are they doomed to three-peat 10th place? It is looking very likely. You already had the stat of, you know, teams that have gone 0-4 to start it out. <laughs> Only two teams have ever made playoffs. And that's a run. That's, that's a jump between you know, 10th place or playoffs or something like that. But you know, people were expecting a lot more from Golden Guardians. Well, there is no defense left. Froggen can run, but he certainly is not going to survive this game. This will certainly end. 100 Thieves will finally get a win in LCS 2019. Golden Guardians sat for them a 0-4 start. Like right after the loss, we were, we were all pretty demoralized. We're like, oh no, is this how it's gonna end? Like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna be on a team like this. I think I, I was super worried about our team. Our team was like 10th place back to back last year. And I was like, hmm, is it right choice, you know? I think it's just like, it's a pretty shitty scenario to be in, but with how our scrims were going and like, how well we played in scrims. We kind of knew that we could get to a good point in LCS if we like kept on working and kept on improving. Starting 0-4 made me begin to doubt myself because uh, we still weren't finding success. So I felt like if like everywhere smells bad, then it might be like your own shoes, right? So I thought maybe it was just me. Uh, I mean, obviously going 0-4 really blows. <laughs> I know everyone's gonna be like a little, a little sad because you know, it really hurts your chances of getting uh, to playoff. The reason why we're failing is because we're not playing as a team. We, we've lacked direction for the past like month and a half that we were like streaming and playing. So after week two, we we changed our coaching staff a little bit where um, Jimmy and Nick swap positions. Jimmy is better about the whole emotional aspect between like teammates and especially the younger guys and stuff where Nick is just focused on the game. Jimmy has a way of making us talk to each other more. I think this is just one of his biggest strengths. He just really engages conversation. I think it helped the players open up and be more uh, comfortable with speaking with each other. So we try to like set goals for each other, set goals for the team. It's do or die time and you might already be dead, is what the math says, unfortunately, <laughs> oh, for no. uh, Golden Guardians. And their, and their road do does get tougher from here. Some heroics out of Arrow, but he's still alone, flashing away, still dropping. Golden Guardians get their first win. Looks like Here's Broken it. Blade goes down. Smoothie goes down. Golden Guardians feeling good as Broken Blade heads for the high hills. Sven falls. The Nexus is open. At 29 to 14. Golden Guardians drop TSM. And that will do it. Golden Guardians back to back wins 2 0 on the weekend. Our first two a week definitely felt really good. It definitely gave us like a breath of fresh air since it felt like the whole world was like collapsing after we're 0 4. And to go 2 0 was huge for our like, for us to make playoffs, we needed to start winning. And getting a 2 0 then was like the best time we could get it. I felt a lot of relief just because I gained like more trust in our ability as a team and also that our chances of making playoffs are a lot better. From doom and gloom, 0-4 start, now sitting at 2-4 and four with a win over TSM here. Golden Guardians starting to turn things around. Our first six games were very dysfunctional at, st at the start. We didn't really play as a team and when we won it was just off of like solo plays and like the enemy team making large enough mistakes for us to win. We didn't really start getting super good until we <laughs> until we started playing Warcraft 3 together around like week 7 or week 8. Frogan just came out uh, say like, hey guys, let's play this game together. And uh, I was like, yo dude, I don't like to play other game. I, I never played other game last year and my uh, for my pro career. I never played other game. And he was like, hey dude, just chill. Let's play together and then let's have a nice time together. I was like, Okay, then let's try it. When the team started playing other games with each other, um, spending more time like just outside of office hours really helped our team dynamic. It really fixed all the problems that our team had with like communication. And I'm really happy and grateful to have a team that is able to communicate like this now. Like after we started playing Warcraft 3, we just I uh, started dumping on people in scrims. Dr. Vintage's Golden Guardians finished that weekend, diving the fountain with a victory over CLG. 
Golden Guardians will win this game. They will improve the five and seven. They are in playoff position. Golden Guardians looking good coming into week nine. They're looking for the 2-0, and they've locked themselves a playoff spot. Golden Guardians will improve to a nine and nine record. They will tie break at the end of the day for fourth seed from 10th place last year into playoffs, into possible side selection. What a split from Golden Guardians. Yeah, I'm just really happy that we, like, we managed to go from 04 and make it all the way into playoffs. No one has, has done that before when there's only 18 games in a, in a season, so that's really, really good. Um, also, the fact that everyone was able to like, keep on working and keep on practicing um, and make it a really friendly environment to be in, it just like, it feels good. Spring Split has played out pretty well. We made history moving 04 and still made playoffs. So going into the season, we started as just five random players playing together, and then going to playoffs, we were finally playing as a team. I mean, I'm always ready. I'm like, I'm a person that enjoys the grind. I mean, that's why I've been in this for so long. I really feel like our team has the potential to make it to the finals, and I know for a fact that all of our players definitely want to make worlds going to the summer season.